show you a new pedestal that we've come up with. It's a secure lighted case, um, top lighted as well, or down lighted as well as um, you have some ambient light that we'll uh, point out here later. You can see right now um, we have in the edges some light coming up from underneath. We've got an LED system in there. And this is with uh, ambient light, and when we shut that off, it really, really looks pretty cool. And uh, it's kind of neat about it is it draws attention to the piece without um, confusing the, um, you know, the glass. Sorry about that light thing. Um, it doesn't turn the glass itself um, obnoxious reds or greens. It just makes a nice little accent. So uh, this piece is uh, pretty cool. It's got um, power that goes up in a secret fashion and that uh, really uh, keeps it from being occluded in any way. We've got a secure way of um, keeping this thing away from the public's hand, but if you could show us, Meg, how you change that glass panel out. It's actually a, an acrylic panel. We have a locking system. Let's see what she's doing there. It's sliding the lock back. It's old school technology. You provide a suction cup there to pull that panel out. So that comes up, drops out, and it's easy to get in and change your display. Um, so why don't you go ahead and pull that out. What's pretty cool about this is that we have a lot of flexibility. Um, we're using a mirror right there. Um, why don't you pull that out and just throw the sculpture back in real quickly. Um, and again, um, this, is, um, this is just one option here, but, but just um, using that mirror really helps bounce the light around and also reflect the part there. So go ahead and pop that out if you would. Pull out the uh, panel. We have an ambient lighting system. And so uh, we could put in different panels. Right now you can see now um, we've got an LED that's on a change cycle here. And if you wanted to take that and kind of go for a more elegant look, can you stop the cycle of that and turn it to a white? Yes. So we have... Um, that as an option, you don't have to get the uh, ambient, but I think it's going to give a lot of flexibility to those of you who want to um, really uh, maximize your square footage and also keep your display area fresh, whether it's a trade show, your residence, or your business. So this is another way to um, accent some work. And if you would throw in that black top, maybe. Um, there's any number of panels that we can put in here, and it really just offers a completely different look. So, um, with this, we change it up and it kind of brings it, I'd say, kind of upscales it a little bit. Um, if you put that sculpture back in, you'll see a kind of a totally different feel. And then go ahead and grab that pedestal, would you? A little 9 by 9 Throw that puppy in there. That, that's right under here. No, the 9 by 9 cube right there. Thank you. This is not too rehearsed, and I don't think we're going to edit it either. So. Um, let's not break our heart. So again, there's another kind of a neat way to um, totally change it out without buying a new entire unit. So uh, this will be available in, as I mentioned, any finish. Um, the locking system is pretty cool. You want to show them that as you put it back. It's completely customizable. It's made here in Fort Collins, Colorado, and not everybody here is stoned yet with that new legislation so uh, it should be, be able to make, be able to be made on time and properly all sorts of attention to detail so we're psyched about it hope to hear from you now that panel's locked take care